time now for another edition of Co-Pilot, and I am joined by two Jet legends. We got Wesley Walker and we have Bruce Harper, two of my favorites. And I don't want to talk over anybody. I, a barber tells me I have to shut up and listen, so I'm going to try to do that. I don't want to talk over my man. All right. Well, Bruce, we're going to start with you. What's your first memory of Mr. Wesley Walker? Wesley had this like long, crazy afro, and he just looked like like a nobody. So here I am, this free agent from Cookstown State College, and I go up to this dude, man. I say, hey, man, come here, man. Help me stretch out. And then he got up and ran a 4240. <laughs> and it was like, whoa, man. Then I found out he's the second pick, you know? I, I, I had no idea who it was I was talking to. But we've been friends ever since, the day one. I just remember Bruce not being tall in stature, but this guy could fly. He talked about my speed. And I had this thing about him. I always said, you're the coldest of the coldest. Wes, I'm going to have you move over just a little bit. There you go. There you go. In the shot. Perfect. Look out your left eye, Wesley. You always talk your stuff. Always make it fun. Hey, man, it's nothing but affection. That's all it is, man. I can, I'm going to always pick on you. Well, I have some clippers and I have a shaver. I need to give you a shave, bro, and touch that up. I know. I know. When you think of each other, is there a game that stands out? Yeah, definitely. Was it five touchdowns, Wesley, or four? Which one, Miami game? Yeah. Was that 86? Oh, which one? Which one? <laughs> yeah, the Miami game was four touchdowns. Yeah. I've had a lot of three touchdown games, but hey, just being with my teammates, that's all that mattered to me. He was, he was great. He always rose to the occasion. Wesley, what about for you? Is there a game that stands out there like, yeah, that's Bruce? Well, Bruce brought a lot of elements to the table, but every game, that I could ever remember. Bruce Harper was a part of our wins, you know, because being an all-purpose guy, you're contributing running the ball, you're mm -hmm. contributing to punt returns and kickoff returns. Talk about that team, talk about being together, what you remember about playing with each other. There's just so many times where we've been able to do things and when we had success and, and we won games, it's because we all contributed. No doubt about it, Wesley, and you were honestly one of the biggest cheerleaders for everything. What was it like when um, Wesley asked you to be the godfather to one of his sons? Man, it, it really blew me away. I'll never forget it because it made me realize that our relationship, our friendship was more than just on the field. You know, he, he genuinely felt for me and I felt for him and his family. And I was so happy when his son was born and. And, uh, and then to be named his godfather. I mean, what an honor, man, you know, from Wesley Walker, you know, it was a big deal. So I'll never forget it. Bruce, were you there when Wesley got inducted into the Ring of Honor? Oh yeah, for what sure. What was that like for you to see your former teammate? In my opinion, it took too long for, for it to happen, you know, but uh, I was not surprised at all. Nobody was surprised. I was surprised. No, you couldn't have been surprised, man. Don't be I so definitely surprised. Bruce, tell me what Wesley means to you, and Wesley, tell me what Bruce means to you. Well, listen, Wesley has always been a great guy. You know, he's a he's a great friend to have. Anytime a guy like him thinks highly of me, that's a great compliment, and I'm happy and proud to say that I am your friend, genuinely, through and through. My friendship is more important than the accolades or things that went on in the football field. We are like family. Uh, I wish we could spend more time together. We talk, you know, at least a couple times a week. We will always be teammates, but more importantly, we will always be friends. And I couldn't ask for anything more to have a better friendship than what we have now. I like being interviewed with Wesley because he talks a lot. So that's good. If you keep telling me, talk to me, brother. <laughs> <laughs> hey, well, it's good to see you. You know you like family and I bleed green and I'm gonna be a, a jet through and through to the day I die. Forever, forever, no doubt about it, Wesley. You guys are awesome, seriously. I could talk to you guys all day. You gotta get back to cooking. I wish you would come over here and take place at Nancy's man. Cause I she... heard that you, you don't allow people to come over and cook. They might be spilling eggs or something on the floor. The, oh, shut up, man. Don't even talk <laughs> to me, Wesley. I might get in trouble. I make them too much of a mess. All okay? right, WW. Be All cool. right, I love you, my brother. You too, bro. Be cool. All right.